Hello, good day everyone and welcome again to our 20th recorded Let's Play session here in Stellaris. So my name is the Fairy Archivist and we're currently playing the United Nations of Seoul. Uh, this is the empire that we made uh, that we've been uh, currently I'm planning to finish uh, on this story. So uh, right now uh, as we can see previously the unbidden or the extra dimensional invaders arrived on our last uh, on us on our last recorded let's play and uh, the UNS is having some problems in defeating them or in specifically as a collective the whole Fornax union uh, of course, uh, what resulted is one of the most uh, largest military defeats of the Fornex Union and the UNS, uh, which happened in the Battle of Bramanef uh, star system. It was discovered later on that the uh, fo that the uh, unbidden uh, fleet ships contain some sort of jump drive technology, which makes them or allows them to move from one system to another. They don't just uh, use hyperlanes, but they do their ships. They do jump. Anyway, the UNS is also equipped with the uh, well. They're also equipped with the uh, jump drive system, although it's not as advanced as what we've seen here on the Unbidden. So right now, um, the current president for the UNS is Secretary Vera Ross, mm -hmm. and it's the year 2378. So, uh, okay. Um, currently, uh, we're kind of a bit of a slumped here. Uh, okay. Um, right, I probably have to add some... Uh, okay, so I'm just going to go add new monthly trade. So probably I'll just buy this one. Um, 250, I guess. Um, okay, uh, let's just minus this one. Okay, so that'll be uh, you know a small uh, percentage for the trade. So it's much more cheaper that we do this this way rather than click every time that we have a deficit. So anyway, um, let's go now on our um, uh, you know recorded let's play and let's continue from where we left off. Oh yeah, I forgot the menu. Um, okay, so uh, what do we have here right now? Okay, uh, we finally got uh, some new industrial worlds here. Okay, um... Okay, I guess uh, we're almost a few days away here, probably a year, when the terraforming uh, project of the whole UNS uh, space is completed. So I expect that there will be at least some boom or... Uh, some boom in the uh, population right now uh, the main concern of the UNS or the Fornax Union is how to defeat the uh, you know how to defeat the uh, this unbidden unfortunately uh, from the vote here it's uh, not very good I do have several uh, uh, several uh, um, I'm not sure, but uh, I have several votes here, and uh, oh, uh, last I checked, uh, we were on the losing vote, but from the looks of it, it seems that we're winning. Anyway, um, by a small margin, of course. So for now, we're all, all assembling our fleets here. Wait, 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 just give me a moment. Let me see the side of the shore, shard, New Amsterdam. Hmm. Get deadlines to reach. Hmm. The shred threat abolish opportunity. Society gained. Well, okay, we got the uh, fortress initiative. Okay, I'm not sure about this one, but uh, in favor of using an eye for a different purpose. Oh, we'll just use it. New Australia is also the same thing. Shred's eye, the core. Okay, so I got the. Uh, anyway, that was the error on my last recorded let's play. Um, 
So I'm now left to two other, uh, you know, the sh uh, the shroud, uh, shard thing of that. Although we're still in the process of reanimating those dead bodies and, uh, you know, putting them on the employee of the UNS. Uh, no, this is the core. No, this is the jetty. Uh, I think I have it somewhere here. Oh, okay. It's 88,000 in the Rixim, so I'll probably put them in the Rixim star system. Uh, this is our fleet. And uh, we'll just merge this, all of these fleets right now. Just consolidate them. Okay. Spaceport reports enemy contact. Spaceports. Oh, it's a, I guess this is the pirate fleet. Um, honestly, there's nothing much I could do right now on that part. Um, what I think I could only send is my uh, void spawn here. Oh, okay, we got now plus 199, which is good. Okay, so we're manage uh, trying to get our economy back. Uh, God, this is gonna be a defeat of the whole Dragon Spearhead company. But they're mostly. Uh, let me check. How's the? It's two million fleet power, and that's a very, very uh, well powerful thing. Permanent communications have been established with the alien. Korean Empire. Commerce Exchange. Okay, uh, Zura Corp. Well met. Okay. Um, Skywatch has sighted a spaceborne life form. Okay. Uh, okay. Well met. Uh, okay. Well, we're not gonna go with that. What's this? Federation XP. What does this mean? Ah, Falar Kingdom. Yeah, the Falar Kingdom has already formally now joined the uh, the Fornex Union. So I hope. Uh, fleet contribution medium. We'll go for medium. We need that. We need to defeat the. Uh, hmm. Yes. Equal. Unanimous vote. Uh, I think it's president decides. Uh. Okay. Separate treaties. Hmm. Okay, so we got one, the Sicilian Union of uh, Fermisto. I have no idea with this, guys. Uh, probably we're having... I don't know how many members now are... Uh, oh, we got 15 members. Oh, no, not 15. Okay. You must are free traders. Okay, so uh, the other uh, subjects of the uh, Falar Kingdom also joined with the Growing Alliance. Hmm. Uh, uh, okay, so uh, at least we have some more, uh, you know, we got more uh, folks here. <laughs> For the moment, our uh, biggest problem right now is this. <sighs> okay, let me take a look. I'll just uh, try to... Uh, sort this thing out oh yeah i forgot to tell uh for every 30 minutes i will be saving my game here as a precaution um yeah as a precaution of course uh, uh we don't want to go back tr uh we, we i was just uh, saying that uh it's a big of a hassle if we do a lot of backtrack so we'll uh you know I'll try to save it every 30 minutes to, in case that my uh, gameplay here crashes, I could just only backtrack for about 30 minutes or so. Okay, we got a lot of... Uh, let me tie one. Huh. Okay, we're still uh, 1500, that's... How about New Malta here? Okay... Uh huh. So we got twenty three thousand Gish. What we go? Okay. What shall we do about Gish? Overlord Garrison. Yeah. yeah. What's the Ministry of Truth? Hmm. 
unity. I guess we need unity. Produces amenities for the subject and unity for the overlord. Aid agency. Yeah, I won't go for aid agency because we need a lot of unity points right now. New Hong Kong. Satellite campus. Uh, aid agency. We need those. Uh, we need those unity points as much as possible. Ministry of Truth and Aid Agency. Okay. Tricky, tricky. Okay, aid agency. Uh, Ministry of Truth hmm. Yeah, so that's what they produce One pie can only support two buildings Yeah, that's okay Aid agency Okay, we'll go for Ministry of Truth So we can add several more uh, influence points here Which we uh, need Okay, I guess let's continue on our uh, gameplay here. Uh huh. So for the moment, um, okay, as expected, our Dragon Spearhead fleet is being pummeled. And most of our mercenary fleets are still missing. Patron, we want. You're looking for tactical insight. Extra dimension. Okay. Okay, just give me a moment here. Um, great, great, great. Oh, great. Oh. Okay, tactical insight to formidable force, extra dimensional invaders. Okay, uh, extra dimensional invaders. Yes, that would be nice. I would like to tactical insight for me to fly extra dimensional invaders. Yeah. Goodbye. Okay, so we've already disseminated technology to our mercenary fleets here to at least, uh, you know, okay, so that we could uh, have at least. Okay, Rosal, okay. Okay, uh, we'll just colonize this with this one. New Gabon, I guess, or new... Hmm. Uh, okay, it should be a European uh, country or something. Um, hmm. New... Um, Okay, uh, I should think of an island nation. Hmm. New, uh... Okay, this is kind of a bit of a tricky thing. Um... Okay, I should think of, uh... Mm. Okay, uh... Well, this is... Huh, a tricky... Okay, I'll just uh, look into my tablet here and see uh, the names of uh, world countries. So I could have a lot of selection. Ok, 
Okay, so let's uh, just give it a moment here. Okay, new Algeria, I guess. View, okay. Hmm. Yeah, I'll just uh, name this one as new. Uh, okay, we'll just uh, wait for a while here. My uh, list is still with. Okay, new Andorra. Yeah, that's a nice name, new Andorra. Okay, that's a list of a count, count, real country here in the real world, so uh, that's okay with that. Uh, we're also going to rename a few countries that are vacant, or at least uh, vacant. But from the looks of it, I guess I've already... Uh, uh, um, okay, this one, Gaia World, we'll probably have to colonize this one, humans. This will be New Bahamas. Okay. And this one will probably be New Belize, I guess. Okay. Yeah, okay, that's a good name. So, uh, okay, let's continue on with our uh, war here with the uh, Unbidden. Whew. Okay, uh, what do we got? Fallen Legion, Pirate Fleet. Yeah, very disruptive. So. Okay, let us see the side of shard. Okay, um four necks four necks union fleet. Okay. Uh we're just gonna assign this one to uh New Singapore. That's gonna be their main base right now. Okay, we'll just, uh, Claws of Black will be the new, uh, uh, Metfell Admiral here. So currently it's still, uh, 11,000, so, uh, that's, uh, uh, what do you call this, uh, okay, did they manage to, uh, uh okay, we'll just retreat this one. So it sustained a lot of, uh, it's almost obliterated, you know, the only thing is right. So only five ships survived here from the mercenary company called Dragon Spearhead. Not a very good sight if you ask me. Oh my god, they're now attacking here. Is there a world here? None, okay. So it's worth uh, three million fleet power, they're spreading eastward. Um, there's a second anchor here. Problem is this. Oh, they connected as well with a gateway. Oh, this is a problem. Hmm. Okay. Um. Wait, wait, wait. Stop. Oh, we still don't have this. Um, thank you. Okay, Rosalgi. Okay, we we don't know how this uh the mercenary fleets here are still uh a Griffin Company. Oh, where are they? Okay, the Griffin Company. Okay, so I guess, um, yeah, we're planning to attack him here, I guess. What's this? Okay, the Griffin Company is the first one. Well, the, <coughs> sorry, the Crimson the Fortress uh, is still out of commission and they're not gonna appear until two months. Not a very good sign. 
Hmm. Okay. Uh, do I still got some uh, envoys here? Okay. Spaceport lost to enemy action. Yeah, of course. Uh, this is the extra dimensional, so uh, we can't really do much about that. No, they're pre they're <coughs> I'm sorry. They're spreading eastwards here. Oh. And we're gonna go for next Union fleet should be here. Okay, we got the Fortress Initiative fleet. Also, have to accommodate them with the Dragon Spearhead. Um, Crimson will be arriving by next month. Hmm. Yes, we are concentrating times for all. These are concerning times for all. Our team's strategic problem solvers has stayed fast for all compass and unwavering dedication to the creating a safer galaxy. We took the rig risk. Okay, well, yeah, good for us. Okay, let's go. Unfortunately, most of my allied fleets here are. Okay, um, we'll probably go take point. Fort UNS fleet, Knight UNS fleet, and uh, second UNS fleet. I think it should be for uh, the third UNS fleet. Oh well, the uh, the second. Yep, this one is also. Uh, I'll just go with this one. Okay, we still have naval capacity here. We got nine thousand. Hmm. Okay. Well. Uh, I'll probably have to set this uh, mouse uh, 90 days debris in Brahmas. Hmm. Yeah, we can command them here. It's a suicide run. So if we feel like uh, we're kind of not doing good with this. No, no, no. We'll just wait. I guess it's, we'll just order our fleet to wait here. Uh, for next Union fleet. Okay, <laughs> uh huh. Alright, so I'm just gonna call in this one as an early timeout, so uh, just give me a moment here. Um, UNS episode 920, letter A. Okay, there we go, and uh, I'm just gonna save this one on the uh, OBS. So just give me a second and I'll just go for a quick, uh, very short break. Okay, there we go. Uh, we had just had a quick break with that. Um, okay, so since we're still uh, planning an offensive, uh, I'll probably have to uh, take a look on my uh, area here. Hmm. New Yemen. 
Okay, um, how about... Gene Clinic would be nice. And, uh... Hmm. Still 1,400 days, that's not exactly, uh... Good in my behalf here. Hmm. Okay, I'll probably have to build some naval capacity here. Okay, Whew, this is very, very tense right now. Because, uh... Station reports enemy contact. Oh god, which one? Oh, okay, our kaiju here is attacking now. Pirate fleet. Okay, so this is the first combat deployment of our uh, kaiju here. Or whatever you could call it. Um, okay, uh, I'll probably have to create more fleets here. Uh, I think I've created a fleet here, a corvette fleet somewhere. Um, oh, damn it. Okay, let me take a... Uh, we should see it here. Oh, okay. Can't find one. Fifth UNS fleet, private security. Well, I could just... Okay. Um, tenth UNS fleet, colossal cloud wings. Oh, this one, I guess. That we're already top of that. Uh, we should have... Hmm. I mean, I'll probably have to create a new corvette fleet here. Um, Sparrow, Stingray, Corvette, and Frigate. So, uh, if I recall correct, uh, the corvettes are very good against the unbidden. Or at least, could stand a chance. Okay. So we got a lot of uh, being produced right now. <laughs> Third and Crimson Company. Okay, the Crimson Company's back. Oh, the third isn't exactly doing good right now. Okay, Crimson Company fleet, we have to uh, go here. I guess. Oh my, the Unbidden just went here. So you can see that it went on a jump drive. Um, I don't know. Oh god, okay. Oh, this is problematic on my behalf. Okay, it's not being attacked. Okay, well, uh... Right, we got a slave market here with our, uh, hmm, New Africa, New Gibraltar, probably go for New Taiwan or something. <laughs> okay, yeah, New Taiwan, you know, probably even welcome robots if they like. We need all the manpower we can get for our productions here. And the void spawn is just uh hmm, okay. Okay, the four next union fleet is just uh, twelve thousand. Not exactly that promising. <laughs> Okay, so how about the galactic vote here? Uh, 1,200 days, why don't they goddamn vote? Calling favors, what's this one? Holy Terrasian Empire calling favor. Okay, they're always... Okay, uh... Restored the shard. Yeah, it's already been restored. Yeah, 
Okay, well, they're all restoring, so uh, they're uh, up to speed with that. Okay, we'll just go for Rixen. Okay, so they've already collected this one. Uh. Okay, so as long as it's uh, spiraling on eastward, I think that shouldn't cause a major concern right now. Sage on manifold. Void spawn, it will be there within 56 days. So that's uh, a bit of a problem. First fleet. No, I have no idea what this is. What's this? Okay, fine. Tell us about we wish to hire a savage overseer. Okay, it's a deal. Special uh, project complete. It's a deal. Mm. Uh, five once more, the ones we got shares are done. Okay. So we got the uh, shard here operational again. Okay, so that's good. Let's just reanimate those uh, guys there. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we'll just reinforce them. Okay. Fleet hmm. lost. What? What do you mean fleet lost? Oh, Zenaya, of course. Okay, I'll let them, uh... Okay, I'll just hire the kaiju here to, uh... Hmm, first combat operations of the void spawn. So it's a bit clunky. It's a bit clunky, but uh, it is now under the command of the UNS, so uh, I guess that's, uh... More of a good thing, uh, more of a good news rather than uh, be intimidated with that. So, yeah, I'm sure uh, the kaiju there can handle a few pirates. <laughs> and, oh well, oh, I guess we lack the, uh, um, the alloys there. Okay, but that's okay. Okay, we'll just... Yeah, I probably have to uh, put the Foreign Axe Union fleet here. What the hell? Okay, uh, we'll just... Hmm. Kinda annoyed if that... Uh Good. I really hate it when the computer is too stupid uh, the to even go to territory for to reinforce itself. I mean, it's too stupid that it goes uh, right in front of the enemy territory just to, uh, you know, reinforce itself. Uh, uh, it's spreading eastward, southeast, from the looks of it. Hmm. Okay, what do we got here? Um, edicts. Mm. 
Mm, we have enough. Uh, Sleep action underway. Okay, yeah, 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 of course. Uh, monthly gain is 1,200. Uh. Okay, so, uh. Okay. God, where's the vote here? Okay. Okay, so are we still in production here for all our shipyards? Uh, where's my shipyard here? Yeah. Okay, so I guess they're doing all their best in the ship production. Uh, let me take a look in the edicts. Hmm. If there's anything I can do to, uh, you know, fleet supremacy, I guess shipbuilding speed. It's not gonna hurt because uh, we need the 2000. Steep charging experience build speed is 10%. Hmm. Okay, I guess that's about it. We need is a grand fleet, which we already have uh, 30%. Architectural designs, proclamation. Hmm. Okay, uh, right. 1,600 days. Uh, that's a lot. And, uh, yeah. We're currently having some issues here. Gripen Company is it uh, marching on its full strength right now? Mm -hmm. Okay, so I guess um, that's it. There's nothing much we can do right now. The Void Spawn is just basically killing off pirates. Six UNS fleet will probably have to be, uh, yeah. Probably assign the six UNS fleet there. The Griffin Company. Okay, so they're encountering some pirates in this area. Hmm. Griffin Company and Fortress Initiative is... Hmm. Okay, we probably have to attack it in two fronts here. Okay, so this is gonna be a very, very uh, long campaign. Naval Logistics... Uh. Okay, right, uh, how about my production? Hmm. Oh, okay, we got... Okay, excellent. Okay, New Spain. What's this? Ah! God, it's already in the middle of a crisis and they're still declaring war. Hell. Can't imagine the logic of the computer here. Hmm. Okay, uh, we'll go for chemicals. Uh, we'll go for chemical plants. Mm. 
New friends. Okay, unification center. Well, it's mostly uh Okay. Okay. Hmm, I forgot tech world. Okay, we'll just uh, put this one. Yeah, probably I'll be establishing uh, some of them to be a fortress world, maybe. Whew. For now, this is a bit, uh, oof, a little bit uh, problematic on my part because I have to keep everything, you know, under work here. Hmm. I rush them. Yeah, that's it. Hmm. Okay, well, they're not exactly thankful for that, right? Yeah, they just took on the hard won victory in there. Science Division uh, reports a new breakthrough. Yeah, I guess I should never uh, go with the tinkering with that. Uh, I shouldn't go with hiring off the salvagers next time. Hmm. Oh. Advanced Shield Hardener. We'll go for uh, Advanced Shield Hardener. <laughs> so how is the fight here? Okay, uh, this one is... Okay, let me take a look on, uh, uh let us take a look regarding the, uh, okay, let's take a look regarding the, um, Sorry, I'm just adjusting my camera here. Uh, let's take a look on the terraforming here. Oh, we've been 144 days. Okay, that's not really that uh, hard anyway. Hmm. Third UNS fleet needs to be reinforced as well. Hmm. Okay, uh, which one is this? Vinjin Station, okay. Um, this is mostly a Corvette fleet, right? Okay, we'll just assign a new one. Uh, probably Yolanda Salazar. How about this will be the seventh UNS fleet? Okay, they survived. Dragon Spearhead is still missing. Oh. I think we should uh, go here. Oh. Uh, it seems the Pandal station is going to be problematic. Okay, hmm. I'll probably have to buy, uh, well, not slaves actually. Wait, buy you pops. Hmm. Okay. Mm 
Okay, so it's currently spreading at a very alarming rate. Hmm. Okay, I'm just gonna send a decoy fleet here. Probably, uh... to send here. It's more like a decoy fleet just to keep them uh you know to keep them at bay. Alright so how about the Union for uh, the Union fleet here? Okay, we got 400, that's nice. So the bigger the uh, unions, the better. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, we could try a little bit of here. Uh, they're gonna jump there, so... Uh, just to be in a little bit of harm's way, I guess. No, 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 no. cancel that. Just gonna be in here. Okay, where's the seventh fleet? I think I saw the seventh fleet. Okay, the UNS seventh fleet should be probably be here. Okay, Divine Kelsan has opened their borders. Okay, that's good. <laughs> oh, defensive aura. Hmm. Shield hit points negative 20%. Yeah, I guess this will be good. Hmm. For the moment, uh. Oh, yikes. It's just uh, keep growing and big and getting big. Hmm. Okay, so our Igarian uh, folks here. Well, they're already awakened, so. Uh, and got enough firepower. Uh, hey, I didn't notice that they have one here. What's this? Shipyard? Oh, they're making a shipyard. How come I don't have one? Mm -hmm. uh -huh. 2.9 and 3 million. Well, it's not impossible, but uh, we gotta go cut a lot of stuff here. And my shipyards here are basically... Uh, hmm. Yeah, but my shipyards here are working already around the clock. Two, three, four, five. Okay, this one's also four. Okay, uh, this one will go through uh, New Taiwan. Okay, whew, 
this is Ringo. Uh, as you can see right now, there's a lot of movement here on my uh, ships. Construction complete. Okay, that's not exactly a thing here. Okay, I'll just... Uh, Okay, for now it's a very busy galaxy and the Ambidden is uh, trying to spread its, uh, itself here. Hmm. But for now, um, it's... Uh, okay, I got two mercenary fleets here. Although, uh, okay, it's still being reinforced. the Fornax Union fleet when you needed them. Okay, the third is still a uh, uh, second fleet. Oh, the river. That's nice. Okay, so I guess we'll just have to uh, wait. Okay, trigger. Okay, disappointing. Help us, let us help instead. Hmm, okay, well, we needed a minute. Special project complete. Okay, so we got the uh, our uh, pet here. Got the uh, hmm, Crimson Company fleet is, is is also on its way. No, no, no. I think uh, hmm. okay. Uh, let's just wait here. Hmm. Okay, so they're hanging out in the star base. Okay, so I'll just uh, wait here. Okay, the river. Hmm. Yeah, we'll try to create a distraction here. Okay, uh, right. So, uh, I guess it takes quite a while Inbound to, uh, message traffic. Watch this. Yes, yes, over migration treaty. So, we got the research commercial packs. And, uh, hmm. Okay, <laughs> uh, he will be the one in charge. Wings of Ebony will be on a suicide mission run here. Uh, 
from the looks of it. Okay, where's my Fornex uh, Union fleet here? Uh. Uh, okay, so I guess it's a bit of a... Uh, yeah. Okay, so this is a bit of a problem. Uh, okay, I'm now over... over naval capacity by 4%. Hmm. So, uh... Yeah. <laughs> Okay, what's this? Uh, unexpected mutations. Oh god, what's this? Okay, um... Our terraforming specials have a good news and bad news for us. The good news is the terraforming process went soon. We have a beautiful guy. Well, bad news is that everyone living on the moon was exposed to terraforming gases and now can't live on a non Gaia world. Oh my god, this Gaia trapped ha inhabitants have surprisingly been showing an increase in their productivity while on a Gaia world. For better, for better than the workers aren't affected by the gas that migrated there later. Okay. Okay, so there were some two worlds there that uh, the species were exposed to a very, uh, you know, to a species that have a side effect. Uh, they can only live in a Gaia world preference, unfortunately, and 73 pops of humans on two planets. Hmm, okay, so uh, anyway, they were afflicted with that, so they're not any compatible with any... Um, any planet uh, okay well uh, I guess that's a setback well although that productivity is increased so that's okay oh god what happened to this one this one suddenly appeared out of nowhere um, I'm not sure if they're not being detected here Well, I guess we got some four next union fleets here. Mm. Okay, just give me a moment here. I'm just gonna go for a... Uh We'll get that out. We don't need their auto design things. For now, uh, what can we say here is that we'll go for interceptors and now... Um, okay. Okay, that should... Uh, That'll be a uh yeah, we'll put it on auto upgrade so I don't have to worry about this one. Same goes with this. So they're frigates, basically we're gonna go for torpedoes. Hmm. <sighs> Neutron launchers uh, and face the structures. So, uh, okay, uh, frigate. Wait. Okay, 
other destroyer gunships. Um, okay, we have whirlwind missiles, uh, gauze cannons, probably. Okay, so that should do it. Uh, save that. Oh, great. What the hell. Okay, uh, clear design and then auto-complete the ship. Um, okay. Face disruptors. Okay, this is shield penetration. Okay, we got... We're good with that. Um, how about the cruiser? Um, okay, for the cruiser, um, probably had a. P okay, uh, we got this. What's this one? Uh, uh, armor damage, hull dam damage. Fine, we're okay with this. Um, Wait, we got an artillery core. Hmm. Now we got artillery bow and uh, hangar core. Artillery should be this one. It's uh, shield damage or something like that. Ah, oh, okay, we'll go this. Um, shield penetration, armor damage, we'll probably go with a laser. Um, go for face disruptors. Okay. Broadside. Okay, spherical mount, okay, carrier core, that's okay. Uh, yeah, artillery stern would be nice. Mm, face disruptors. Focus arc emitter, I guess. And for the Titan, uh, yeah, I guess two of these. Okay, so I'm just gonna save this one. Uh, oh, okay, so this was a very, very, uh, oh, very, uh, what do you call this? A very uh, brain intensive uh, work. So, anyway, well, just save this one on OBS and uh, we'll take a short break after this. Alright everyone and uh, welcome back so let's continue uh, we got uh, we got that after the short break here so uh, yeah I just made some changes on the Federation ships here so at least they could stand a chance against the unbidden of course they got wiped it out uh, no surprise with that um, okay where's the four next Union fleet? Oh, gotta hate this. Okay, so I'm just gonna pause this one because 
Um, oh, God, I really hate this. So uh, we'll just... Uh, You imagine it's a very long list that I have to manually Okay, um No, oh, that's a nice name, Carnival of Carnage. Whoever thought of that? Okay, um, so we got a lot of guys here. Okay. Whew, that is a lot. Oh god, can you imagine this list? That's a lot of lists that we got here. And uh, basically, the Federation here is littering my uh, naval unit skill, uh, my naval unit menu here. Huh. Well, I guess that settles it. Hmm. Yeah, can you imagine I spent almost four minutes now doing this? They should have an easy button to, uh, you know, connect the, this uh, whole fleet here. This is really a hassle. Can you imagine? I have uh, my whole menu screen here is cluttered with uh, micromanaging the uh, fleet here. Okay, so it took me quite a while. Okay, uh, oof, can't imagine that was uh, very tedious. And uh, uh, can you imagine my uh, gameplay here would even? Uh, oh yeah, my gameplay would even, uh, you know, hang from that uh, menu thing. Whew, was totally a chore. 
Okay, uh, what do we got from New Brazil? Um, it's an industrial world, so we better have... Um, yeah, we better have some something here. Factories, or I guess. I uh, wish civilian industries will do. Okay, it's a forge world, so... Uh, Okay, whew! Okay, the seventh fleet is still... Oh, okay, it's full strength. Hmm. Okay, we got the Griffin fleet fully, uh... Well, on full strength now. Uh, let me check the... Right, uh, Griffin. Okay, uh... How about, uh... Extra dimensional, okay. Goodbye. Okay, so that should do the trick. Mm -hmm. Then Pandal System Crimson Company. Hmm. All right. Okay, uh, Crimson Company is currently. Uh, what's the Sidron Manifold? Ah, huh. great. <laughs> right, uh... Okay, so how many more are we technically restoring here? Ah, oh, god. Keeping the uh, the unbiding here at bay for now, huh. so we'll just uh, let this one play out. Oh, okay, we got some several uh, worlds here that have. Uh, oh, what's this? Toxic throwers. Ah, extra dimensional armada. Mm -hmm. I know that's mm -hmm. not going to end well for them. Okay, that's not gonna be the 76th fleet. Um, okay, uh, we got the second. Uh, probably we'll just rename this 11th UNS fleet. 11th UNS fleet. Our Minkian station. Construction complete. How about uh, Admiral Ati Ozozan? So he'll be the one uh, on the 11th. Okay, um, got the 75th. So we're enforcing a uh, Okay, this one's 450 for the Griffin Company, so uh, probably uh, they'll probably boost up their numbers. So uh, yeah, we just have to simply wait. <laughs> Crimson Company is also uh, yeah, it's still just half of its strength, but. Uh, 
uh, it's uh, already formidable. So, uh, hmm, okay. So, how are my shipyards? Yeah, probably my shipyards are just basically uh, uh, churning out every. Okay, uh um, are there any more? Yeah, I'll probably upgrade this one. 19. Uh, yeah, Krant Station will be a fully uh, fledged uh, shipyard. And, uh, I don't know, maybe Rinkyo here. Okay, even is already a shipyard itself. So I probably have to add... Okay, orbital shipyards. Okay, New Libya is turned into a Gaia world. Okay, we got some several... Uh, okay, folks here will definitely love... Uh, They'll definitely love the uh, uh, the uh, new place that's turned into a Gaia world. I mean, they'll definitely love the planet because it's now a Gaia world. So I'll be expecting some uh, production highs on that. Okay, uh, but for the moment, my uh, naval capacity here is a bit uh, over blotted now for 13%. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, uh, they're pretty much busy. Okay. Speaking of which, how is the vote going now? It's 917, that's at least two years before they make a vote. Ah, great. Who's this? Governor Baker, age at nine, uh, 98, okay. So we're just basically uh, doing some strength here. Uh, Okay, they've been destroying the uh, Falar Kingdom fleet here. Ah, makes me wonder how are the conditions... Uh, okay, we got some several vassals here now as well. And now we're, uh, we're already their protectorate, I didn't know about that. Huh. Okay, uh, we'll probably go with the aid agency. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> right, uh... Okay, these are uh, troubling times for the uh, UNS from the looks of it. Hmm. Okay, we got a hundred uh, hundred thousand now. The fortress initiative is still out of commission, unfortunately. Now we can begin a counterattack, I guess, on some parts here. Hmm. Okay, so they're already spreading uh, westward or uh, eastward here. Oh, we got two dimensional anchors, unfortunately. Not very good. Hmm. Uh, two million. So, uh, unless we get some, uh, uh, some, uh, miracle here, uh, the unbidden will probably troll its way, uh, eastward. Hmm. Oh, great. My ship is almost. Spaceborne life form. Okay. What the hell? Where's my uh, shipyards here? And my third UNS fleet is still not uh, ready. Hmm. 
Okay, so it's a very, very... Uh, anyway, my gameplay is a bit slow now because of all the vessels coming in and out of this area. Um, practically, uh, uh, almost whole of it, actually. The Falar Kingdom is also pumping up their shipyards, which is uh, basically the second largest uh, or second most powerful uh, stellar country, uh, stellar nation in the uh, Fornax galaxy. Griffin Company, 7th UNS fleet. Okay, so we need at least 10. Uh, hmm. Alright, uh, how about the... Uh, okay, well, I'm just gonna go for a diplomatic uh, contact here. Um, yeah, how about the curator order? Uh, okay, uh, can you offer our customers? Uh, right, that's not really a... Yeah, we still got the shroud. Majority but all for association status. Parking that was just to Yeah, trust we'll give them an associate status. We need uh, a lot of members for the union. Okay, how about the fortress? Okay, so we're just basically dumping a lot of, uh, uh, you know, a lot of, uh, whew, a lot of uh, technologies being disseminated throughout the whole uh, galaxy against this unbidden. But unfortunately, we're not making a move. They're still continuing rampaging here on their uh, eastern end. Uh huh. While well, our fleet's here. Hmm. Uh, private security. All right. Uh, probably have to go with this. Okay, Dragon Spearhead Fleet, come on down. <laughs> okay, let me check their uh, corvettes. Okay, it's still the old neutron launchers. Hmm. Yeah, well, anyway, that'll uh, should have been a torpedo boat or something. In the meantime. The vote is still. Uh, extra dimensional invaders are th a threat to all life in the galaxy. If we do not unite to stop them, they will overwhelm us all. We should make dealing with this crisis the galactic focus. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes, that should be our galactic focus right now. Hmm. Unfortunately, uh. So uh, it's gonna be a very very long uh, recorded let's play because uh, well taking down the uh, cr event crisis here it takes quite a while especially if it has a two million oh my god they've already entered the rank system here oh it's a small system okay not exactly the uh... all right um, what do we have here. Tokyan monument. Yeah, we'll probably have to build. Yeah, let's see if there are any other planets here. Mm-hmm. 
that needs to be upgraded. Hmm. Let's see if there are other plants here that needs to be uh, upgraded. Oh my. Hmm. Okay, there we go. Whew, this is really a very, very... Special project uh, complete. Yeah, okay. That's good if it's a special project. Do your thing. Situation log. Oh god, well we do have a planetary build speed here. I guess this is the problem with the error. I still have... Oh, um... Uh, restore the shard which is here hmm. okay we got two and five orders so uh, that should do the thing hmm. and we got three shards here now Let me check this one. Seems to be the problem with this. One forty eight and it's one fifty. Well this one's one fifty, so we're good. Well so there have already been full strength. So we'll just probably have to wait for the reinforcements. Yeah, Tarvalem is being uh, wiped off. Okay, uh, this is a real, uh, really big problem right now. Uh, the, Inbound uh, message traffic. Okay, yep. Mining station lost to enemy action. Let's just wait until our, uh... Oh god, even the vote here takes quite a while. It's 814 seconds. That's not gonna fly. Hmm. Call in favor. Offer trade deal. Just give us, uh, how about... Um... Trade action. Pledge loyalty. Prospectum techniques. Favors. Okay, uh, we'll just uh, probably go trade off with resources, specifically alloys. How about dark, ma dark matter? Oh, I know what we got. Give out consumer goods, no? Minerals energy. Yeah, zero. Um, how about a hundred? Two hundred? Three hundred, okay. Confirm. Okay, call in favor with this one. Uh, call favor with the... Hmm, how about the Falaire Kingdom? Okay, let's uh, offer a trade deal, shall we? Uh, one favor, I guess. Um, resources. How about uh, alloys? We'll give you a set of... Oh god, this one's a really greedy bastard. Okay, uh, about zero. Okay, that's good. Let's confirm that. Okay, so we need one more vote just to swing with that. Mm -hmm. Oh god, uh, the uh, Azanti... Uh, 
will probably be annihilated with this one. The Azanti Confederacy. Hmm. Our pioneers have made planet fall. Okay. Sovereign state of fervor night. Okay. Um, call in favor. Yep, we need that. <laughs> so for now, it's just only political. Uh, uh, let's just say the addressing the galactic community. <laughs> okay, for our kingdom, that's good. We're gonna call in one favor here. In the Falar Kingdom, we need you guys on our side. Okay, that's good. <laughs> okay, the Confederacy is being, uh, yeah, they're spreading eastward here, and there's a lot of them. The arbitrators here. <laughs> Invite the Federation, but we don't have excellent, uh... Huh. Okay, but, uh... Our trade deal. Resources, information... No, can't really offer anything that's, uh... Oh, it's anything that is interesting. Okay... Got the Griffin Company, the Fortress Initiative, and the UNS 7th Fleet. Okay, it's already 77,000. <laughs> okay. Yeah, we still got a lot of reinforcements coming here. Mm -hmm. Rosalge. I guess the... Um, this one should be... Rosal gay, I guess. That's our uh <laughs> Science Division reports a new breakthrough. Okay, Dragon Spearhead Fleet. Right, assembly organisms, assembly speed which is good. Um Battleship pattern, cruisers, nanite repair system. For now, we need an advance cruise. Uh, Titan. Yeah, we could go for a Titan, but right now we need an advance afterburner. So that's good. Eight months. Uh, we need an af advance afterburner for our Corvettes. Because they're gonna be, uh, you know. And a big fight. So for now, the fleet is holding this one at bay, and okay, we got some uh, getting support here. Um, okay, how about this one, the Storm Rider Prime? Okay, how about uh, we offer you a trade deal? Give us a favor, one favor. And we'll give you a resource, specifically, um, I don't know, maybe alloys. Okay, and, uh, think about rare crystals. Okay, on second thought, never mind. How about zero? Oh, stay. Yeah, okay. Okay, uh, well. you are a hive-minded dolphin. Anyway, we're now going to our... Uh, I'm just going to save this one. So we're now going on to our last... Uh, record last 30 minutes of our recorded Let's Play session here. Uh, on our 20th recorded session. So let's save this one. And I am going to save this uh, on our OBS. Okay, welcome back. So we're now going to our final 30 minutes. So let's uh, continue. So for now, 
Ah, the ruined orbital. I guess it already doomed. Oh, I hope those guys did made it. Or oh, okay, they're not bombarding the planet. Okay, well, I guess they're safe. They just ruined some pops there, but uh, I think they'll be fine. Although their orbital ring has been destroyed. Uh. Okay, so I guess, uh... Okay, we got the, uh... Hmm. We are still assembling the largest fleet that we have here. So I guess it's now, uh... Ooh! Okay, 3rd UNS fleet is still uh, out of commission. Okay, we're just gonna make the, uh... The 132nd, the 12th UNS fleet. 12... Okay, there we go. And this will probably uh wings of ebony will be Okay, good pleasure doing business through political dealings. Um well they're still angry at us, but uh the, I mean the Uri Remnant is still angry. But we're not exactly uh you know Tracking spaceborne life form. Oh, glor, glor, gork. Oh my god, the Hydra spearhead. Uh, we would like to rent the fleet. Okay, oh. uh, right. Okay, how about this, guys? Uh, okay, so anybody here that has uh, uh, some sort of uh, mercenary group? Hmm. Yeah, okay, unfortunate. What's the problem with this, guys? Yeah, we'll open borders with you. And we'll establish an embassy. Same goes to you, we're gonna open our borders and... Uh, okay, they don't like uh, the embassy. Okay, forget that. <coughs> Construction complete. Okay, open borders and establish embassy with these guys. Okay, so we're, uh, you know, <laughs> the, I guess the envoys of the UNS are trying to address and appealing now to the galactic community of the Fornax galactic community to uh, aid us or aid the uh, UNS in its uh, fight against the, uh, the unbidden. <clears throat> and how come this still survive? Hmm. Okay. Right, crap now is being uh Okay. Okay, we got now a newly opened uh shipyard here. Oof, okay. Right, good. They opened their borders to us, we opened our borders to them. Mm-hmm. 
Yeah, I, I get some uh, message and for uh, information from my uh, iPad here. <laughs> so for now, it's just mostly preparation against to uh, you know to fight the uh, ah Boris Naval Cluster. Okay. Okay, that's good. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I guess we got uh, we're now uniting as well the fractitious uh, former united uh, Khans uh, stellar nations or I mean the former Khanate uh, factions have been also been united or been uniting I guess uh, whatever you call that Hey, uh, what's this? Hey, how come we have a closed borders? Oh, they still uh, are. They still close in my borders. Okay, that's okay. <laughs> okay, so we got 1,900, and we still have at least uh, two years before the Senate uh, or the Galactic Community Senate, uh, you know, approves that. For the moment. Uh-huh, we got all to uh, unite this. Okay, we gotta recruit a Furbanite warrior, uh, Stockholm Stellharm. Our pioneers have made planet fall. Okay, so it's a very, very long campaign. And, uh, yeah, okay, what do we got? Hmm. <laughs> yeah, we're still, uh, yeah, I think we should position our uh, forces here. Uh, murder of Fuch or something like that. Uh, we gotta uh, at least uh, inflate our uh, inflate our uh, Union fleet here. Hmm. Crimson Company Six UNS fleet. Check the uh, policies, uh, war philosophy, rapid deployment, uh, hit defense. Special intent. project complete. Hit and run. Hit and run. For now, we're gonna go with a hit and run. Because we can't uh, exactly. Uh, hmm, can't exactly. Uh, you know, fight it on a on a direct uh, fight. Okay, we got three shards. We're gonna transfer them here, and we're going to ensure that this uh, dragon guys here are uh, ready for battle. Okay, we gotta position ourselves here. Mm -hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay, let's see how this works out. Whew, this is gonna be a very, very... Uh, what's this? Unsurveyed system. Okay, we should uh, have a very good... Uh, hmm. Currently have neutral relations from them, so how do we, uh, you know, have them, uh, you know, have a good, uh, well, they're still going eastward, so, uh, 
Do 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 do. Hmm. Okay, this is getting a bit of a tense thing. Uh, outpost. We need 48, so we're just gonna build an outpost here on a barren world. It's just uh, right near the processing. Uh, this. Yeah, just right in the steadfast echelon. Oh god, the midfell is almost, uh, you know, the midfell is almost devastated here. Hmm. Right. Their station's been destroyed here. Alright, I guess that's to be avoided. Uh, that's totally unavoidable. Uh, even the... Uh Inbound message traffic. Yes, yes, we're gonna offer immigration treaty here. So they're now right at the border here. Okay, so I guess it's now time for a test battle. Okay, before that, let me state this. Uh, okay, uh, what do we got here? Measures... Uh, build ship speed, defensive war effort, how many we got? monthly gain yeah I guess defensive measures I guess okay mm. this is a bit of a problem for me but I'll go with farming and uh, Wait, we'll just have to, uh, yeah, okay, let's continue. Oh god, this is gonna be one heck of a battle. We have at least two million. Man, this is gonna be a... Uh, yeah... Oh god, I hope this is not gonna... Yeah, it's gonna be a messy fight. We got even several other fleets here as well. Okay, we got the United Nations, so the Fuller Kingdom, several mix of all other... And yeah, well, they got no choice. So we are now assembling our fleet here on the battle. Yeah, okay. This is board. Yeah, we'll keep it like this, uh, just for cinematic purposes. We got the whole uh, UNS, the UNS uh, fleet here. Uh, <laughs> okay, 
Okay, so I'll just uh, give me a moment here. It will create a distraction, I guess. Um, oh god, you even have this. So, uh, yeah, I guess this is a big, uh, fight. Well, uh, they're also establishing, uh, I don't know. Okay, so we're sustaining, uh, yeah, it's gonna be a very big, uh, This is now the scenario. Okay. Well, at least we did poke them in the eye. It's now 1.9 million. So mostly most of the casualties here will be the heavy battleships, but the cruisers and the corvette, uh, I mean the corvettes and the frigates will probably be doing fine because they've already been equipped with uh, shield and armor penetrating weapons. At least that's the best the, our uh, UNS scientists can think of right now. Or the best that they could ever hope for. And we still got the mercenary fleets here, about a hundred thousand. So, uh, but unfortunately, the mercenary fleets here are mostly used capital ships, and uh, they could easily get down uh, the uh, that uh, th that uh, those capital ships could easily be down by the uh, disintegrators, uh, weapon disintegrators of this uh, unbidden or the unbidden. Hmm. Of course, expect heavy casualties as the unbidden flow through this area. Okay, well, uh, they're not jumping, so which is good. The Griffin fleet and the. Huh. Mm hmm. Okay, that's good. Uh huh. We got the one the Oh god, it's really eating them up. Okay, well at least we smacked them. It's now one hundred one million eighty nine. Oh god, which war thirty first fleet got destroyed. Well we don't really care much about them anyway. Okay. So this is a good battle, uh, you know, battle uh, situation right now. Okay, we're just gonna get some videos here. Okay, I'm just uh, probably have to get these videos uh, just for uh, story purposes, of course. Uh, it's good that we could see the whole uh, wide fleet action. Uh huh. Okay, they've already uh, one fleet just retreated. Um, Casualty is Admiral Mode Lockhart, UNS Interpede was destroyed, yeah, uh, this is war of course. Casualties are unavoidable. But uh, let me take a look. What part of my fleet here? Uh, uh, 
Yeah, I guess that is a big issue right now. Uh, I think Lockhart was destroyed. But at least we're holding off. It's 2 million now, it's 1.7. Unfortunately, most of my... Uh, this is the Crimson Fleet, I guess. Yeah, Crimson Company Fleet. They're now 76. They're kind of... You know, doing some cha-cha, uh, I guess. Very first fleet was construction complete. But anyway, my tactics is clear. Um, oh my God, the uh, the tenth UNS fleet was totally destroyed. The fifth UNS fleet was totally destroyed as well. Okay, uh, casualties are at Larry O'Malley, uh, Riga was destroyed, Admiral Ariana Alexki died, UNS Ganesha was destroyed, 10th mm -hmm. and the 5th mm -hmm. fleet was also wiped out, but we did punch a hole with this. Science ship lost with all hands. Yes, scientist Yunus Azofi was also destroyed, so it's a major battle. Uh, we're probably gonna go with another shipyard. So we got the uh, two fleets have been destroyed. Uh, this is... Okay, okay, we'll just... Uh, wait, you at night UNS fleet will have to retreat. Uh, first UNS fleet will have to retreat as well. Uh, six UNS fleet. Now the Crimson Company will have to, uh... Okay. Admiral Bagog died. Oh, Icarus. Yumi Yamazaki. Mm -hmm. Ursula died. Oh god, there's a lot of, uh, vacancies at the moment. Okay, uh, we're not gonna retreat. Okay. Well, at least we reduced it to one sixth. Um, I don't know. I think so. We need to produce more, three more fleets, I guess. Yeah, third UNS fleet isn't doing good as well. Okay, so another major loss with this one. But we did poke them in the eye. They're from 2 million, now it's reduced to 1.6. So probably we'll have to change tactics. We're just going to be producing or mass-producing corvettes with anti-shield uh, anti, uh, penetrating. Uh, okay, the cows and alliance. It's still 514. Okay, so we lost a major battle here, so the Crimson Company is still holding on. the shard. Don't tell me they're also fighting. they just be eaten. Uh, Rixum isn't... Uh... Okay, uh, moving to your this system. Okay, that's good. Still, uh, whew, this is a major war right now, but I have no idea why the Crimson is still. Hmm, oh, I don't know what's the secret within there. Well, I guess the Crimson Company is very lucky. 
Or maybe not. We don't know. Oh, the Crimson Company is obl obliterated, I guess. Oh, one shroud was killed. Also destroyed one... Uh, They're only composed of nine, uh, well, nine corvettes, and they're able to hold off, uh, yeah, one of the shrouds got killed as well, that's okay. Okay, the shroud is also killed, this... Okay, well that was, uh, well, that was brutal. Okay, so we're just gonna go for a secret mission here. This is something that should not be Griffin Company, Fortress Initiative, and the 7th UNS Fleet will have to attack this one. Yeah, I guess this one will have to stand by, the UNS Archimedes. So we have a secret mission here to destroy this so we can reverse engineer anything anything that comes out of it. Person Company Fleet is still doing their stuff. Okay, so uh, yeah, okay, the battle was lost with that. Okay, the 13th Corvette Fleet. This will be the uh, 13th UNS fleet. Mm -hmm. Oh wow, Cass in class. We'll, we'll, be, we'll have to manage this one. Um, and ship designs. GN, Sparrowhead, Corvette, Tomcat, Frigate. Okay, uh... Yeah. Okay, so that'll be it. Okay, uh, where's the 13th Corvette fleet? Uh, we'll probably have to sign a new leader. A Zeno would be nice, but we only got humans here. So Pietro del Grosso will be uh, will be the ones assigned on that on that assembly. Science Division report success. Okay, good. Okay, advance afterburners. Uh, how about Ripper Cannon? Cross and thermodynamics. We got nanite repair system. Tracking spaceborne life yeah. form. I guess we'll go for nan. Well, uh. Well, we'll go with this one. Yeah, three months and then the nanite repair system. Whew! That was a major battle, which is Battle of Aethior. The Crimson Company is still holding. We'll probably have to go for a retreat. Okay, that's good. That's good. Extra dimensional. Well, we did poke them in the eye for 1.7 million. No orders. Yeah. On second thought, Fortress Initiative, Dragon Spearhead. No, I think I'll go, uh, for next Union Fleet. For next Union Fleet. Okay, we'll just keep it like that as a standby.
with Commonwealth. Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay. Well, that's uh, pretty unavoidable. Anyway, I guess we have to conclude our recorded Let's Play for now on this. Uh, so I just have to save this one. So that was a very action-packed, uh, you know, action-packed recorded Let's Play. Because, uh, well, um... We have, we saw the main battles here, uh, two of the major battles for the uh, Foreign Axe Union, and of course it's always defeat because, uh, you know, well, the enemy is very difficult. So uh, this will continue again on our uh, 21st uh, recorded Let's Play, and hopefully we could probably in some ways turn the tide of the war. But for now, uh, the Unbidden is steamrolling itself. Uh, eastward on the Fornax uh, Union. So uh, let's see if uh, this battle is winnable. And again, uh, I do appreciate a lot for those who are watching this and I hope to see you on our next recorded Let's Play. So bye bye for now. This is the Fairy Archivist and uh, yeah, see you on our next recorded Let's Play. Bye bye.